Welcome to Learning Bite, short job bites of inspiration that you get to apply immediately. We're exploring how to engage your team more and leverage the combined creativity of all the people you employ. In my experience, many companies fail to get full engagement and because of that fail to benefit from the creativity, the imagination, the ideas of all the people that they employ. We're aiming for this series to help you to tap into the knowledge, skills, experience, ideas that your team has. And we want to do this in a fun and creative way. To start off with, we're going to get you to bring your team together and to show them this short video clip around a very simple acronym that is used in sales and in marketing. We've covered them before in our learning bites, and that is ADA. As a company, you need to be able to get people's attention, grab their eyeballs, get their focus. Once you've got their attention, you want to be able to stimulate some sort of interest in what you do. Once you've got their interest, you want to create a desire so they want what you're offering. And you want to make sure that that desire is strong enough that they actually land up taking action. And so what we want to do is, once your team understands the importance of this, how do we, as a company, get people's attention, stimulate interest, create desire, get people to take action, when people know that and understand it as a concept, what it then allows us to do is to work as a team to go, how does every single area of your business, from the incoming goods, the purchasing department, the accounts, the operations, the dispatch, the sales, the marketing, how do all of those team members come together to see what can their department do, what can their area do to actually help do that? Now, we're going to give you a very simple table. We've taken ADA and added two R's onto the end of it. And we've got a question for each and every team. How does your team inside the business, what is it that you do that can get people's attention? Maybe when you're dispatching, you could put a personal note in it. Maybe if you're in the accounts, you can look at the way you lay out your accounts. Are they friendly? Do they engage people? Each and every department can do something that will in some way impact all parts of the process. Get together as a team, think about what do we do as a team that impacts the attention that people have, the way that we get people's focus on our business and company. How do we stimulate some form of interest, create desire, get people to take action, but also how do we get people to make referrals? And what do we do to go towards retaining people? When each and every department focuses on those key areas, what begins to happen is we begin to get a swirl of ideas. And oftentimes, it's what you do internally for each other that lands up having that external effect. Remember, the internal culture of an organization creates the external customer experience. Sit down, work out what you can do, and you'll see that you make a difference. If any of this resonated with you and you'd like some help with it, do feel free to get in touch. Drop me an email at mike at thinkright.co.nz or 0272 987 523 or our website www.thinkright.co.nz.